Dear viewers, I hope you are all fine. This ultrasound video shows bilateral enlargement of the seminal vesicles. The seminal vesicles are paired, paired accessory sex glands of the male reproductive system. The seminal vesicle produces over two-thirds of the ejaculate and is very high in fructose. You can see the urinary bladder and seminal vesicle is visible. This is prostate and you can see on either side of the prostate there is a seminal vesicle. The seminal vesicle, also called vesicular glands or seminal glands, produces and secretes the seminal fluid which contributes 50 to 80 percent of ejaculate volume. The normal seminal vesicle measures 3.0 cm plus minus 0.8 in length and 1.5 cm plus minus 0.4 in diameter and the ampulla of the vase difference measures 0.4 cm plus minus 0.1 cm in diameter. The ejaculatory duct measures approximately 4 to 8 mm in diameter. Now you can see the seminal vesicle on one side, right seminal vesicle. A portion of the prostate is also visible in the center of the picture below the urinary bladder. Each seminal vesicle spans approximately 5 cm though its full unfolded length is approximately 10 cm but is curled up inside the glands structure. Now you can see the measurement of the gland and it is slightly enlarged in size. The seminal vesicles, ejaculatory duct and sphincters are important paraprostatic structures as they may be either individually diseased or involved as a part of prostate disease. The seminal vesicles are positioned above the prostate against the posterior wall of the urinary bladder. Now you can see the left seminal vesicle and it is also slightly enlarged in size. The seminal vesicles, either of the two elongated sac like glands that secrete their fluid contents into the ejaculatory duct of, the, of some male mammals, the two seminal vesicles contribute approximately 60% of fluid passed from the human male during ejaculation. The seminal vesicle glands secrete a complex fluid. The main role of this fluid is to facilitate sperm's, sperm survival and transport through both male and female reproductive tracts to enable fertilization. Seminal vesicles is an uncommon entity characterized by Inflammation of the seminal vesicle, it is most commonly infective in etiology and often associated with concurrent infection elsewhere in the male genital tract, forming part of the spectrum of male accessory gland inflammation. Hyperspermia is a condition in which man, a man produces larger than normal volume of semen. Semen is the fluid a man ejaculates during orgasm. It contains sperms along with fluid from the prostate gland. This condition is the opposite of hypospermia where is when man produces less semen, uh, semen than usual. Now the fate of the sperm after prostatectomy. A man will no longer ejaculate semen if he had a radical prostatectomy. This is because the prostate gland and the two glands called the seminal vesicles are removed. These seminal vesicles make 
the fluid part of the sperm the testicles will still make sperm cells but they will not they will be reabsorbed back into the body you can find some important information in the description of this video thanks for watching please subscribe my channel if you do like this video please click the like button thanks